right guys, hey Dave Hall here with Restore Muscle Car. We have a uh, pretty nice collection of the early bull nose, basically your 70 to 72 Trans Ams in stock right now. They've uh, actually been a pretty hard car to, to normally get and so we've been kind of collecting on them here for the last uh, better part of a year and uh, both from some clients, uh, some stuff that we've had from before and we have uh, like 10 different pieces right now. Uh, I think six of them are gonna be blue and then four are white. We have two that are the super rare 72s and they're both four speed cars, a blue one and a white one. We have, I think six 70 Trans Ams right now. The rest are HOs. So anyway, we have a collection here that we wanted to kind of show everybody. Um, Several of these are up for sale now on the website. A couple of them, we're still finishing a few little odds and ends. So we're trying to get some updated photos. We wanted you guys to know that uh, we love these cars. These are one of our favorites, one of my favorites. Um, in high school, I had a 72 Trans Am that was almost identical to this car, except it had the white interior in it, which we have an, an automatic car in the back that's a blue numbers matching uh, deluxe white interior. HO car, but I still have my high school car. It's um, been with me ever since. I, I did sell it once when I was in college, but I was able to buy it back um, almost 15 years later or 20 years later, I can't even remember, but uh, I, I, so I still have it now. These early cars are great cars. These are mostly our numbers match original uh, motor cars. I think we have a couple of pieces in here that don't have an original motor. We do have a 70 automatic. Actually, I'm sorry, it's right here in front. This 70 automatic car has a 455 in it, so it's not a numbers match car, obviously, because they only had the 400 motors. The Ram Air 3s and the Ram Air 4s were available in, in 1970, and then that's when they went to the 455s in 71 and 72. But this car has a 455 motor in it. It's all documented on our website. It's a super clean, solid, super fun running and driving car. It does have uh, the correct rally wheels and stuff on it. The, the rally wheels on the early cars were actually made up of, of uh, 14 inch centers and 15 inch hoops that were welded together. They only made them for a few years, and so they're very hard to usually come by, and so it's not very often that they are available um, on these cars. The, the rally wheels, the 15-inch rally wheels are what would have came on 70 Trans Ams only. They didn't actually introduce the honeycomb wheels until 71. So we have uh, several of them that do have honeycomb wheels on them. Then 71, 72, the honeycomb wheels, they're, they're, basic, they're a really heavy wheel actually because they're a steel, um, they're made out of steel but they have a polycast center that makes up the honeycomb on it. They're a, kind of, so it's kind of a, a flexible rubbery feel. It takes a little bit of work to get them used to restore. A lot of times they, they can get hairline cracks and stuff in them, but um, they actually are one of my favorites. That's what I had on my high school car. I've always loved seeing them on the cars, but I really like the rallies too. Um, out of these cars, this collection of cars we have here, most of them are four speeds. We only have a couple automatics. This one is a four speed 72. That one's a four speed 72 blue one. This is a four speed blue 72. I'm sorry, that one was a 70. The one up there was a 71. So the two 72s right here are both four speeds. This 70 four speed car here, this one's just finished getting a frame off restoration on it. Um, we actually just sold this one yesterday, so it is not gonna be available. But I do have another one just like this, identical options, that is painted and starting to go back to, uh, together. So it's a complete rotisserie car, numbers matching, uh, rebuilt drivetrain, and it's got the bright blue interior in it. I believe this is standard, and so the other one I think has deluxe interior in it. The, uh, and the deluxe interior would be like a custom weave, which actually is the same interior that's in this blue four-speed car here. So this 70 car here has the, the deluxe weave, which is a really pretty uh, interior. This one right here is a 71. It's a 455 HO. This is an automatic car that's got air conditioning, power windows, 
and the really rare white deluxe interior. It is a very nice car. We're just finishing up some little detail work on it and stuff now and we'll have it. We don't even have this one on the website yet. I'm hoping by this weekend we'll have it up on here, but all these cars jump in, turn the key, they fire right up, run and drive great. And like I said, most of them are all numbers matching. Um, this 71 four-speed car, it has a 455 motor in it. It's not the original motor to the car. It is just now got posted on our website this last week or last weekend. And so it's available, but they're, the prices are gonna range probably from uh, 50s all the way up to over 100, depending upon the car, the options, and the rarity, of course. But don't hesitate to call us. Um, let us know what you're looking for. And if one of these cars interests you, I'm more than happy to give you more details on each individual one specifically. We're trying to get all the descriptions up to speed, getting all the pictures, top to bottom, inside and out, and undercarriage, so that way you can see everything that we have going on with these cars. We do, like I said, have a couple of formulas in stock. We have a 73, 354 speed car, and then we have that one owner 70, it's a 400 automatic car. And those are both looser and blue cars, super nice cars. Um, our orange uh, 73 is uh, shipping out uh, this next week, so it's already spoken for. But we have one other 73 red Trans Am that's available that uh, is just coming up on the website this week. And it's a, it's a very nice uh, frame up restored car, numbers matching, air conditioning, automatic. It's a red with the black deluxe interior, super nice car. Uh, I don't expect it to last long, but we're going to try and get this video out for you guys, hopefully within the next couple of days. So that way you can just see everything we got going on here. So make sure that you like, share, tag, follow Restore a Muscle Car on our Facebook, our website, our Instagram, and especially our YouTube channel. We're trying to come out with uh, weekly videos to kind of update you on not only the cars that we have available in house, projects that we're working on for customers in the shop with all the techs and um, new stuff that's coming in. So we have actually some pretty neat stuff that we're gonna be posting this week on some really rare cars that we had coming in from some clients. Thank you.